Today, we're going to teach you how to install elementary OS. Yes, hello, welcome. Welcome back guys to another tech video with Human and Sutton and today we're back with another Linux distro OS. Today we're installing Elementary OS. Today we're going to install Elementary OS as I said, the fast open and privacy respecting replacement for Windows and Mac OS. Look at this nice OS here. We can see it's a quite nice website with all the information here. You can see that it has multitasking view picture-in-picture, picture, do not disturb, apps you need without once you don't. So only the essential apps will be there. So don't worry because you will have everything from LibreOffice to a calculator. And here you can see additional screenshots. It looks like a nice OS. So we're gonna download the OS right now. I'm not gonna pay something right now or donate to the company but do it if you're gonna use the OS support elementary OS. Okay, we're gonna download. And now while the download is downloading, we can go and search for Rufus. And the official website here. And now we're gonna download Rufus Portable here. Let's wait for the download to start. Now it's starting. And now we're gonna wait for Elementary OS and Rufus to finish the downloads and then come back to you guys. Now the downloads has finished. We can go ahead and double click here on Rufus. Press yes, yes. And now we're gonna select our USB flash drive. I have a Kingston here, eight gigabytes. It's enough for the system here. Now we're gonna select here the IC image, Elementary OS. Partition Scheme, MBR, Target System, BIOS or UEFI and now we're gonna press start here and be sure to back up anything you have on your USB flash drive because it will be formatted. Press yes here and write in ice image mode recommended OK and press OK here and now it will write a USB flash drive bootable with elementary OS so we can boot into this and install elementary OS. And we will be back when this is finished and install elementary OS. Now we're gonna boot into the USB flash drive that we just created. We're gonna hold down the volume down button and the power button here because we're using a Surface Pro generation one. It's different for every computer. Please look into your manual in order how to boot into BIOS here, the boot order. I'm gonna release the power button and release the volume down button. Try or install elementary OS booting in five seconds here. Wow, what a nice logo there, Elementary OS. And here we get the option of try Elementary or install Elementary. Of course, today we're installing Elementary OS. And now we're gonna press install. Now we get the option to try Elementary OS or install Elementary OS. And of course today we're installing Elementary OS. So we're gonna press install Elementary OS. And here we're gonna select the Wi-Fi we have here in this household. Connect. And I'm gonna write down the password here. And now we're gonna press connect. Continue. And install third party software for graphics and Wi Fi hardware and additional media formats. Of course, we're gonna do that because we want full functionality from the computer. So press here. 
and then hit continue and here an important step here now we want to erase the disk and install Elementor OS because we want a clean install but this will of course erase everything you have on your hard disk drive or SSD programs, documents, photos, music and any other files in all operating system so be sure to back up everything every important file you have before installing Elementor OS and now install now We're gonna hit continue. And of course Stockholm here. And now human and Sudan as our name. And we are gonna just let this be as is. Okay, it requires a password, we're gonna just for testing purposes, one, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. And we're gonna log in automatically because we don't need the security here. Continue. And now it's copying the files and installing the OS. So we're gonna wait a while here for the OS to finish the installing process. Now the installation is complete, you need to restart the computer in order to use the new installation. So we're gonna press restart now. Wow, we booted into Elementary OS and we are welcomed by Elementary OS. Continue to set up some useful features. Visit the links below for more information about Elementary OS. And here you can see, uh, we can press next, location services, yes. Nightlight, no. Housekeeping, right now, we're not gonna do that. Get some apps, not now, and ready to go. Wow, this is amazing. You can see how clean the OS looks and we will dive into this in our upcoming video where we will demonstrate the capabilities of Elementary OS and the UI itself. Thank you so much. Wow, Elementary OS, so easy and simple to set up and install. Wow, what a nice looking system we got here. Human will demonstrate this in our upcoming video. So stay tuned for that video. And with that, I want to thank you for watching and tuning in to Human and Sutan today. Don't forget to hit that thumbs up button to show some support and love here at Human and Sutan. Comment down below if you have any issues or other questions to us at Human and Sutan. And be sure to share this video so anyone can enjoy this nice tutorial. And don't forget to hit that notification bell so you can get notified of our new videos because Human will upload a quick overview video of this elementary OS and the most important things of them all. The subscribe button, please continue to support us. You have shown us so much support and love here. We have grown so much together and we hope to do so more with you again. Thank you so much. And don't forget who this is. Human. And certain.